Three or four, if I'm not wrong. So, if you watch the other episodes, you have known that um, today is my last day in Busan, and because it's the last day, we wanted to. Yes, we wanted to try Busan's most famous food. I mean, of course, I keep saying they have a lot of famous food, right? But this one is a favorite among the locals, and that's the reason why we're gonna bring you there. I feel like this is also one of the foods that if you don't eat it, you are gonna miss out on Busan delicacies. So, Let's head there and then I'll show you and tell you what it is about. Let's go. Oh, and I'm just outside my hotel. I just woke up and Naughty said that I have to just come out and I just come out like that. And um, so I don't know how I'm gonna eat in the morning, but I, I can do it. Okay, let's go. Where do we go? Okay guys, so here we are at the Teji Kupak Kori and it's a kolmok if you want to say it. So basically, it's a whole lane that sells um, pork rice soup. Pork rice soup. Okay, that's a very um, comfort food for Busan people. I mean not only Busan people, I'm sure it's a comfort food for everyone in Seoul. But particularly in Busan, a lot of people really like to eat this in the morning. I want to eat yesterday and he was like, no, it's a morning food. I was like, okay. So, here is the lane that sells all of it. You can see the steam coming out and stuff. So it's just soup and then pork slices and you have rice. So we will teach you how to eat it the Korean way, but it's so cold. <laughs> and that's the reason why you have to come here. It's really near, uh, we're in Seomyeon, right? So it's really near the subway. This one is really near Seomyeon, uh, York, okay? Yeah. So um, according to our Kun Ajobonim, which is my Elder's brother-in-law um, recommendation because he's from Busan. <laughs> okay, he just, he recommend it uh, us to go to that one, the Songjong Sunday, Akupa Santai. Santai is like a it's past three for generation. three generations. It's Chinese, I know. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not from Chungo. So you Chinese? I'm Singaporean Chinese. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna head there and then we're gonna order the food and recommend what's best to eat. So. Maybe like this, right? <laughs> what? There's so many people in the morning. What the heck? In the morning? But I don't get it because it's like eating bakute at what? It's 9 plus, leh. And it's 24 hours or more. Wow, okay. Let's go in and see how, what's so good about it. Okay. Okay. So we already entered this place, and as you can see, it's bustling with people who eat soup and rice in the morning. Is everyone just more than me? But everyone eats chicken rice in the morning also, baby. Where? God. We eat kaya toast and bread. That's you! Only your family. Okay, guys. Please be a judge on this, okay? Do you eat this kind of thing in the morning? Singaporeans don't eat Okay, anyway, so... Um, we ordered something called suyuk chikpan. Suyuk is like a um, steamed pot. And you're supposed to eat it with like uh, different sauces. And then the very famous kukpap also. So I don't really know how to eat it. I remember the last time I ate it in Busan, I didn't have a good memory because right? the soup is white, right? So I don't know, but well, we'll see. Hopefully it's good because this one's a good one. So yeah. 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 Okay, so both of the dishes has come already. So mine is um, this soup together with the meat. Um, the rice always comes up together and then uh, this one is like the meat is inside the rice. So I don't think there's a very big difference. Just that this one has more meat definitely so you can see. Oh and I think it was quite interesting that they had the chili here. So mine is here. Yep. So I think you're supposed to stir it. Don't forget uh, to put I, salt. Do uh, you want to explain how to do it? Okay, Since after it's a this.
Okay, so not gonna teach you how to eat it. Um, so I think definitely I've run that one differently, but usually I you want to put this in this small waffle. What's that? Chai. Uh, yeah. So put this a bit. Then after that, so this is very salty, very very salty. So do not so much. Okay. Just put a little bit. It's like seo chop. What yeah. seo chop? Seo freezer front. Now yeah. that you have paste it. If it's very plain, in your opinion, you can add like some salt. That's a lot, sorry. I don't think that's a lot. Just try first. You have a tendency I to tried. add extra. I tried. I mean, you have a tendency to add too much. Um, I like pepper, so on your paper. But there's no right and wrong how to eat that because it's, you know, food, food is always like how you like it. Mm. Then after that, we want to be more. Dump the everything, whole rice inside. Yeah, everything you must put here. So, um, as you as you say, uh, as you know, Busan has a lot, a lot of like a sad story when doing the war and all. That's why they say there's no time to it. That's why everything dumped in the one bowl. Uh, because no time, no time to thinking. Okay. Mm. Yeah. The normal wow, way to eat some. The meat The food right? Not so heavy. But it's ten. Just nice for breakfast. <laughs> Ah, feels good, really good. And this thing, like, I don't know why, when you eat this one, you cannot eat nicely. You know? Yeah, I'm a skin guy, try it. Try it, babe. That's why I put salt. I say put salt and say, babe, let's do salty, babe. You must try this first. I better see how much salt you put. Very plain, in your opinion, you can add like some salt. That's a lot of salt, babe. You better put. Babe, that's too much, babe. You must try first. It's so bland. Then you save me just up for what? I put a way lesser than you, babe. What you said to me just now? That's a lot of salt, babe. Ah, see, you put too much ready. Mm. You're, not, you're not gonna put the rice in. Yours. Okay, try the meat. What do you think this as a breakfast? I think I can eat it once. Every day, right? Yeah. No. Very mm. soft. But no smell, right? The kupra, although it's a pork. Mm. It's nice. I feel like. See what I mean by comfort food? Because. It's too heavy. Can I always eat it? It's not heavy, right? It's not heavy, la, but. Wow, it's a lot. But I think with the rice, it's nice. I'm just gonna eat a piece of rice. See how salty it is, yours. Hey, yours confirm saltier. You'll be shocked. <laughs> you just told me to not put salt. A lot of salt. No, the one. I like it a bit plain. Hey, hey, go on, go on. I don't eat it. Okay, let's go. Go on, do it. It's yours. <laughs> oh, but if you put pepper, is there a difference? Go on, do it. You eat your own. You eat your own. Oh, a little bit only. But you say me just now. Mm. Mm. Nice. 
Jadi lah, it's not so hot lah Busan style breakfast, what do you think? I think it's very acquired taste Huh? Acquired taste Oh, it's nice. I thought you were being sarcastic. It's very quiet place. I heard. Oh no, a quiet. I think it's nice. Um, and you should try it. But maybe if you are like me, cannot eat in the morning. You can eat in the noon lah. So it's twenty four hours. And this is one of the many stores that are here. So you can try mm. the other stores if you are okay to just if you are adventurous. But it's not. That's the reason why I'm introducing this to you guys. So. This is by Busan Fellas. Yeah, please try it and let me know what you think. Because to me, when I see this kind of soup, right? You know, we always drink the soup that's very heavy, but this is very light soup. It tastes like water with. Huh? That doesn't sound nice. No, before you put the salt and all that, it tastes a bit like. Oh. Cream, right? Before mm. you put that. But after you put, right? It does taste like a dish because it's like salt with um, the broth of the pork. But yeah. I think I can see why the Busan people are like it. Gong Sheng Do people. Take the noodle lah. Uh, I don't want. I mean, I, I'm okay with it. Every morning, I can come down here, man. You can order every morning if you want to. No, I'll just come down again. Maybe we should figure out how to cook it. I think it's nice when you cook it in a big pot. People should come down at home, party at night, and eat good work in the morning. They go and sleep. Uh. Hmm? Pass you until morning, eat ready and then go and sleep. Oh yeah, maybe. That's why it's 24 hours maybe. Mm. I didn't oh, talk hey about it. Hey hmm. hey hangover. No. Hmm? Hey jang too is hangover soup, but hey jang is to wake up from the... Hangover soup, no? Hangover. Yeah. The very last pop day. Wow, so nice. Yours a bit salty, babe. So what you say just now? Just a lot, sorry. So we're kind of done with the food now, and um, I'm not sure if you guys, after watching this, you'll try it because it looks really good and it's a good comfort food. And I will recommend it to you guys who are traveling with your parents. I think my parents will like it a lot. With your, I wouldn't say it's old person food lah, but I think they will like it way more than the young people food because it looks. Yeah. I would say it's not aesthetically presented and I think in Gen Z, our generation, we need to look at nice food to eat. Adult, but, I think, will like it. Yeah, adult will like it. So now it's not like, uh, it doesn't look that pretty, but I think adults will really know how to appreciate it. So, do try, okay? Both of it was done by... What, you? you eat I pay, I pay for you. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I really scanned the table if someone was drinking. Someone was really drinking beer already. Yeah. <laughs> drinking beer already, eh? This is how they make, I guess. Yeah. This is Korea, right? Yeah, very, very Korea, I think. Then you just need some beer for the corner here. I think it would be nice for you to come to Busan. Uh -huh. to see a different side of Korea because Seoul is very city and I would say actually it's very similar to um, South uh, to Singapore but Busan is like a, something that you cannot find in Singapore because Busan, I wouldn't say it's kampong lah, okay? but it's like JB, what's up, what's up? it's like going to JB from <laughs> Singapore like that Maybe Yeah, but because JB, JB is not kampong but it's just a different like, Less developed lah, less yeah, developed Yeah, it's a village, not village I don't want to make it sound bad, but you guys know what I mean, right? It's a lot nicer though, Let's I like see. it. 
and it's like if you want to escape from the city vibe, that's where you come. But it doesn't mean that it's too ulu as well, so it's like on the some sweet spot, I guess. Yeah. Now coffee, I buy. Okay. Yay! Thank you for the coffee, Nasi. Thank you. Onni Sonda. Onni, I'm not girl. Oi. Nuna Sonda. What Nuna? You younger than me. How's Samian in the morning, babe? Uh, I think it's a just very different vibe. But the thing is, I don't even know how it's like at night. But I think it will just be very crowded because it's like Hong Day, and it's very interesting that there's people like walking around and stuff already. It's so early in the morning. Yeah, and it's thirty first. Oh yes, it's thirty first, guys. But if you are watching this video, it's probably two weeks into January already. And highly <laughs> likely, I'll be in Singapore already. So we're heading to Singapore next week. So we're gonna surprise them. Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> Got karma! So we're gonna surprise them. And then, um, please look forward to the next video. I think, I mean, next few videos. Next video will still be a Busan episode, but next few videos of surprising my family when we get there. So, thank you so much for watching this um, episode of um, Tejik Bab. Um, please stay tuned for more Busan episodes coming up. And I will see you in the next video. Kiss me, babe. It's like a music video. You must run, babe. Why never run? <laughs>